Hey there YouTube, Hippelinger here, and uh, back with Sif Beyond Earth. And um, let's see, where we left off last time, we were going to, uh, well we're going to end this turn, and then we're going to explore, and we'll meet a new Sif, apparently. Uh oh, he's way, way out there. Let's African go, uh, Union uh, is clear over on the other side of the map, though, and... I can only assume the map will wrap. Um, yeah, see there. You can see up here on my mini map how I go from one one side to the other um, when I do that. So he's not technically that much farther away than anybody else. So we'll just have to keep that in mind. Uh, a lot of miasma down there. Trying to be careful. Oh, look at that. Franco Iberia already has a colonist built. So he's out for expansion. Fantastic. And I'm, I'm kind of holed in a little bit here because... Um, you know, I can't really get anywhere going this way without killing aliens, uh, and I don't really want to do that. Um, I could come up here to build. Um, I guess I probably could technically build here, but they overlap a bit. Um, so I'm not sure what the best route is there. So we'll have to take a well, I'll have to take a look. I don't know. I guess I don't need to be, you know, the most. Um, smart with how I play. This isn't about that. It's about learning, right? Okay, so let's make sure we've got this before we get our, to our expedition and then we'll work on our... Well, hold on. Let's see. So that went from 24 last time to 36 this time, so let's assume it's going to go up another 12 for the next one. Um... At five a turn, it will take, you know, almost ten turns. So yeah, let's let's go ahead and make sure I've got that one. I'd love to have a speed up on my buildings, but we'll just go with that. So I just want to make sure I get that science. Okay, he finally landed. Let's make our plantation. Because that'll get us a speed up on those buildings, right? Alright, so we can get down there safely. I can tell you which, uh, which explorer is going to get my MVP award here. One's got like 20 resource pods under his belt, the other one's been stuck for 20 turns. Alright. Can't really get that way, and I don't want to land on the alien nest, so I think I'm gonna just hope that siege worm doesn't come my direction. And let's get this pod. More energy, so I'm just stockpiling energy here. Xenomass with no alien nest on it, that's good to know. Alien wolf beetles. Let's see. Okay. All right. So thankfully, I almost moved to that square. Thankfully, I did not move there. Of course, I can only go one square, so. Well, no, or square. I keep calling them squares. Bloody hex. What kind of... Oh, look, that's a mountain. Interesting. I guess the mountain has been, like, cratered, but it still counts as a mountain. So, good to know. Now, let's see what our quest update is here. Uh, for your eyes only. 
mysterious encrypted transmission received from an unknown origin. After some considerable effort, his, it has been decoded. The clear, clear text reads, The Culper cell requires infrastructure for covert operations. Should you choose to accept, you will be rewarded in time. So apparently we need to research computing, which is underway, so we shall have that taken care of pretty soon um, as we focus on Goodness gracious, these guys are creepy sounding. Um, so yeah, covert operations soon. Alright, next turn. Aliens, aliens everywhere. Discovered Fort Barca. Fan Ya Hezu. Guang Zong Yao Zu. Two energy, two production, to any city that establishes trade route, only one city. Okay. So she built here, okay. Fort Barca showed up there, which I'm guessing was kind of like how we got to allow a station to show up. I'm guessing it's them allowing a station to show up. Oh man. Prosperite, right there. So. My path is going to be cut off unless I come through here by this alien nest. Or get unit embarkation set up, which I might need to get that going soon. So, okay, unit needs orders. So let's explore some more. Little by little, I'm going to get there. I swear I am. <laughs> This crash satellite is the hardest thing to get to. I mean, look at all this alien activity right here. It is insane. I mean, there's no way for me to get there. So, stay put. And I think I landed in my asthma. That's not good. Be really funny to piss off some aliens and let them attack people or something. That might be something to learn. How you can interact with people. I owe you to perish, but never want to approach towards the alien life on a planet. So apparently he is also kind of choosing not to attack them. Sputnik, Slavenska Federacja pozdrawiaje tibia. So Slavic is, let's see, this is our last one. Is that everybody? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, and six. So yeah, looks like that's everybody. Alright. Let's see, unit needs orders. So yeah, you see here he was he was lost ten out of his hundred hit points sitting in that miasma for that turn. Can't really go anywhere from there. This guy also can't go anywhere. Still for another turn because it's just getting frustrating. Alright, so it appears that our worker has finished. So We'll get more production if we go there. Yeah, we'll just keep doing that and then we need to get some food rolling. So. Alright, so. Pan Asian has decided to attack the aliens. And they have at least a couple sets of soldiers. So I'm gonna have to watch out for them. I need to get my defenses ready. For what they might bring. Let's see what options. Construct a generator, changes the tile to two energy, or a mine gives us extra stuff and roads. Yeah, I'm not a big roads person. We shall just explore. Little by little, we're getting closer. Uh, 
Boy, this uh, being next to this civilization with animations on might not be a good thing because that's going to take a while if they keep attacking every turn. Yes, I finally got moved on to it. Well, let's hope they don't try to kill me. That way, so we're kind of away from the action. What's this? Okay, gold. That's a new resource we haven't encountered yet. So that's cool. All right, so our production choices. We just got done with building the trade outpost. Fantastic. So now we can do a trade convoy. What's a trade vessel? Oh, naval trade unit. Okay, so trade convoy is what we're going to want because we want a land trade route. Um, we'll probably want some of this stuff later, but let's focus on getting this trade route going and then we might get a colonist. We'll see. Of course, we have something else I want to build at that point in time. Never know. Yeah, see, I was afraid of that. They're gonna attack me. And kill me. So there's no way to get to that crash satellite until I'm either friendlier with them or kill them. That's unfortunate. I, I had a strange feeling this game was gonna try to bite my hand like that. All right. We have a free solar collector to throw up. That's awesome. And we can keep moving. So, oops, I didn't mean to. All right, solar collector ready to launch. So if we hit this button, we launch. Do nothing. Sleep. Delete. All right. So let's just launch it. And I assume if we just like stick it over top of our city, it will just feed. Hey, I unlocked an achievement. Um, I assume what it does is it doesn't tell me a whole lot. When you hover over things in this orbital layer, it should let you see like what that particular orbiter does. Um, but anyway, that's all right. So I assume it's just going to feed us extra um, energy. Uh, I don't know precisely. So unit was killed, found a resource. Um, yeah, maybe between turns I'll, uh, or between episodes, I will look at the Civilpedia and see what a resource or a solar collector does precisely, or, you know, how it functions. Alright, so I will just keep exploring with this guy, since my other guy is dead. Uh, trying to get that satellite and I'll just I think I might just have to give up on that satellite until um, ooh, what's this derelict sat settlement all right I need to get to that before he does and he got there first Dang it. Uh, let's start a war I don't want to do that yeah, if I move one square at a time, or hex, one hex at a time, oh well. It is what it is. Not a whole lot I can do. But learn and do it differently next time, maybe. Okay, we'll probably be doing some building soon, so we might want to do that extra culture. That positive health. Each city tile generates extra science. Now let's get our extra production going towards our buildings. 
And next one, we might want to get this food retention going. And I think we need our city to grow a little faster. Because um, the borders are starting to grow faster than our population is. And let's get over there and build a farm. So we can use that. Too much miasma there. Okay, go back up this way. Not much for me to do, so let's go back and hover over our city. And we did hit, yeah. Okay. Damn you. And made myself. I can't believe I. I can, I make mistakes like that all the time. So everybody watching, learn from my mistakes. Move your explorers one at a time. Alright, let's, uh, let's see how this trade convoy wor works. Establish trade route with Badumasa. Oh, I see that gives you ways to filter. So that's where we want to do it. So yes. Okay. Build action. We want to build a farm. Changes tile plus two food minus one production. And we get production from removing the forest. Which is fine. We will do that. We need the we need a little food bonus. Really? Yeah. The advisor... The advisor recommendation kind of lagged a little bit there. Okay, so our options now. We can consider doing a colonist. Um, we've got our trade convoy working and we can only do... One with that... Right now, I don't think they didn't give us anything else as an option, so I assume that means we can't trade with you know this neighboring city right now. I don't know if it has to do with distance or or if you can only do it with those stations. Um, but also didn't give us this Fort Barca as an option, so I don't know if we need to have a more you know, maybe you need roads to be that guy. I don't know. So, we shall see. Um, so, let's see what our options are here. Cyto Nursery. Let's get our science rolling a little faster. And an extra health. Father Lab, extra health. Uh, fence. Kind of keep the aliens at bay. So far, they're being okay. Uh, they're staying close, but they're not encroaching too bad. But it'll take 10 turns to build that should they start to be an issue. The Therium, just as extra food. Uh, we could get a soldier to be on hand to protect us. Let's go ahead and get this nursery going and then we'll look at maybe a soldier um, on the next build. Le commerce fonctionne okay. quand on comprend l'autre. Negotiate passage through our territory. She wants. She's going to give us a favor. She wants energy and open borders. Let's see. Let's knock that down and let's make her give us open borders as well. I think not. Le commerce fonctionne. Nope. I'm not gonna give that up. See, okay. Let's just test this out here. Okay. Oh. Still gives us an expedition option. 
right. Well, we're going to do this out of curiosity because it doesn't make sense if the other civilization already did an expedition there that we would have the option to. Um, but maybe we're going to find a bug. So let's go ahead and do that just out of curiosity. And hey, there's a kraken. Looks like a mountain in the water. Anyway. So we'll see what this expedition thing turns up. Um, like I say, I'm curious if that's maybe a bug or something. Uh, looks like this is going to take a few turns and we don't have anything going on this turn. Okay, so expedition completed. It did work. So we got some extra culture, which uh, probably gets us darn close to our next virtue. That's cool to know and see you can see here now we have zero expedition modules. Oh, he can do it again if we get him back to the city. Unfortunately. I don't think I have any way to get him back there. But we'll try. I did not know they could refill their expedition modules. That's cool to know. Alright. Far base one. So, where was that? Like, oh, it's kind of just on an island, the water south of us. So, if we create a trade vessel, we can get out there. That's cool to know. Okay. All right. So another unit here with uh, wanting orders. Explore up here a little bit, maybe. We'll see. Okay. So next turn. Okay. Ah. So. They are attacking. Probably because I'm there. They're mad at anybody in the area, and because Tiang Gong has been attacking them. Uh, so. Great, I'm gonna lose my other explorer because. I got too close to a very, oh, I see, I was close to the nest too. So they felt threatened and I was close enough to be threatening. So I need to be a little more aware of where those nests are, I guess. All right, let's take a look here. This will be our last turn for this episode. So let's uh, look at our options. Um, quest log updated. Fresh specimens. They want us to kill 10 alien units to unlock the secrets of the ecosystem. Okay, well, I'll keep that in mind, but it's not on my top priorities list. Culture developed. Let's work on building our city uh, growth and a production. Um, can up our health a little bit, but I don't feel like that's... Again, the ultrasonic fence is a viable option, but again, we haven't really threatened them. They're not bothering us. So we shall do soldier next turn. I would like to go ahead and get a trade vessel going to this one down here, and then we'll do a soldier next turn. So, I guess that'll be our game plan. We will see if there's any way in the world we can get our explorer back to the city, or at least back to a somewhat safe zone, and uh, we'll work on building up this city, uh, we'll do this trade vessel, then a soldier, and then probably a colonist after that. Um, 
and yeah, I keep playing around. I'm seeing what our options are. I'm curious to. I'm, I'm kind of feeling like maybe we need to put a colonist over here and make use of more of these. Boy, that's a, quite a bit of fungal uh, resources. Actually, I feel like we need to get up here. Um, we'll have a lot more variety available to us. Really nice to get the silica and stuff, but I don't know if that'll be possible. But yeah, it's, we need to shut down a few of these lanes. So I think our, we need to get a colonist rolling up here. Um, so hopefully next episode. So until then, uh, YouTube, have fun.